Hey guys, what's up? I thought I'd share a bit more about my book coming up, uh, Soul Traveler. I've had this title in my head for the longest time. And it's piece about why we had these dreams, you know. And, you know, you know, when we go into that deep REM, REM, sleep, that is when something activates those dreams, whether it be dreams of bizarre dreams that we have. So I'm going to read this, what dreams mean. Dreams can be entertaining, even disturbing, and downright bizarre. Especially um, when I have those vivid dreams uh, or premonitions, which eventually comes true. Um, you know, And even if we do, or if we do, remember them the next day. If, but if we do remember these dreams the next day or so, there is a specific message, right? And if we don't recall these dreams the next day or so, then it's like the exact opposite. I think there's really no meaning. So. You know how sometimes, I know this, for me anyway, I think it's different with everybody, but you know this, we have those really strange, vivid dreams, uh, especially during the eclipses, right? Or the full moon. And uh, so it appeared to most believe that during the full moon or even the eclipse, uh, we hit those out here a lot. Um, it's when paranormal activity might pick up, right? But that's just a theory. Uh, yeah, so it makes you wonder why we dream, right? Why, why do our body, uh, our mind, our soul dream? And I think because while we dream, um. The spirit world can contact us easier, right? They, uh, spirits, uh, past loved ones, friends, pass on the other side. It's like, because we're in that deep, relaxed state of mind during the REM sleep. Um, so, if you do have those, what they're also called, uh, visitation dreams, uh, be sure to pay attention to those type of things because there may, there may be some type of a message for us, right? So, um, I can share one example. My, um, grandfather paid me a visit and I didn't even know he has passed on. And then, uh, only I saw my mind's eye an image. I don't recall him saying anything. It's just that I saw him, you know, looking at me, like, <laughs> and then, um, so the next day, uh, I actually remembered it, so that's, you know, it has some meaning to it when you remember it the next day or so, so I called up my, uh, my stepmother, um, and, uh, and she was like, yep, you saw him, he says, for a fact, I have seen him because he has indeed passed away. And, uh, I don't know how he passed, but, um, I think I'll call her up to see when, uh, how exactly he passed, but anyway, I know he's pretty old and probably old age and my stuff's going on, but. Yeah, it's quite amazing. It's like one of my first or second relatives has passed on that actually visited me in dreams. Usually, spirits, they want to contact me from also medium or impact. Um, usually, they'll wake me up. This time, in fact, I was asleep. I want to say maybe it's a death premonition. 
Um, I hit to experience those more than, uh, these visitation dreams, but, uh, yeah, so I had this title in my head, Soul Traveler, for the longest time, because not only are my dreams very, uh, powerful, uh, premonitions and visitation dreams, I really want to touch basis on that in this book, and, uh, I do also Astro travel, or jump, <laughs> he must dream, or dream walker, yeah, just dream walker, right here, okay, alright, section about that, right. and, um, uh, and you, you guys know when, you know you woke up and you had a dream, but you can't remember it, but you just know, you just know, you just had that weird dream, but you can't shake, you can't shake it off, like, Sometimes it sticks with you for a while, even though you can't recall is that what happened in that particular dream. I can tell you that's another scary one, actually. It still haunts me to this day. Oh, in the year. One time, I was dreamed that, uh, I don't know if it's to me, or I saw someone being sawed. Like, that's so many, but, <laughs> no, it's, they had the... Uh, they were laying on the, what do you call those, the mill when they had those long, um, uh, tree cutters, right? And the big wheel of the, uh, the big cutter wheel, right? The saw. I saw that it's like, it's, it's like this, you know, the wheel, the, the log, and here's the saw, right? <laughs> right, anyway, <laughs> that's what I saw, and then... And then, um, very rare, I'll smell dreams. You guys ever smell dreams? I think there's a word for that. I just can't recall it right now. But, I was smelling, I kid you not, I was smelling the sawdust from the saw. I smell it around real quick. Now, that really spooked me. <laughs> when, you, when you, um, Smell your dreams. That's another story. Okay? Another story. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoy the story. I mean, I have some more stuff for you, so, um, stay tuned. Alright, don't forget to like that bell. Yeah, I do random videos, so. Why do you stay up so live? You saw more love from my channel and like this video, like this share if it resonates with you. Alright, guys, peace out. Happy 4th.